why don't we just start by, can you just tell me about Casey Carlisle? Um, yeah, Casey is basically sort of your typical uh, bookworm type girl. She's um, an outsider, but she's not um, uncomfortable with that. She just sort of loves education. Um, and um, her mom has always pushed her towards Harvard. And she starts a physics project, because she's a physics buff, um, in order to get a scholarship to Harvard. And that project is about ice skating. And she realizes through that just how much she really loves ice skating and um, decides to follow her passion despite what her mom wants and become the ice princess. Can you relate to Casey on any level? Um, I can relate to her in the sense that, you know, she followed her dream and, and set goals for herself to achieve. And that's, you know, definitely what I do. I'm all about following your, your dream and believing in yourself and, and saying, you know, I want to do this and working really hard at getting there. And how did you get involved with this project? Um, well, it was actually pr pretty cool. I mean, I'd been wanting to do a movie so long about, you know, girl empowerment and, and a girl sort of kicking butt. Um, and Disney came to me with this movie and they said, you know, we think you could really be the Ice Princess. This will be this will be a lot of fun for you. And I liked the character. I thought she was really inspiring. And then they told me I had to train for eight months to be an ice skater. And that was, uh, that was really intense. So um, I had to sort of work my butt off and, and, you know, take the bruising and the falls and the bumps and jumps and all that kind of stuff and um, just tough it out in order to get a good project for Were me. you excited about ha learning how to ice skate a little bit? And yeah, I mean, I loved watching ice skating when I was little, so um, it was sort of beautiful to um, imagine myself to be an ice skater. I just didn't realize how hard it would be. It's, it's so intense, and I think ice skaters all around the world deserve as much kudos as they can possibly get because... They work really, really hard. And what was it like working with Michelle Kwan? Oh, Michelle Kwan was great. I mean, she was only there for, for a day, which was, you know, sort of frustrating because you just wanted to, like, talk to her all the time about, you know, all these different things. And But I actually got to ice skate with her, and she just floated onto the ice. And um, it, it was so wonderful watching her go around. And, and um, she was really supportive of my skating, so that was really cool. That's very cool. Um, your character has one of the main complexes between her and her mother. Mm. And can you just, what do you think people watching this film can get from watching that conflict and seeing how it kind of plays out? Well, I do think at the core of this movie is that mother-daughter relationship. I think that um, it's always a struggle for a parent to sort of let their child go and not to keep on projecting their own wishes on their on their kid. Um, and it's sort of hard to say no to jo Ke Joan Kisa because she's amazing. But, um, you know, my character just feels to go to Harvard wouldn't be the, the right path for her. She's, she's all about ice skating. That's her dream. And at that point, I mean, no parent can deny their child their passion. In the press notes, you mentioned you, one thing you liked about this film is how this girl finds her path and right. gives a message of trying just follow your path and follow your heart. Mm. What do you want your audience to get from this film? Well, I'd like, you know, every little girl in the audience to sort of see the movie and, and feel empowered, just feel strong and, and look up and say, you know, you know, you may not necessarily want to be an ice skater, but, you know, maybe you want to be a, a teacher, a doctor, a lawyer or something. You know, I want them to say, I can do that. I can, you know, Casey did it and she was scared, but, you know, I'll put my mind to it and, and you know, I'll, I'll succeed. That, that's what I'd like them to take away. And what was it like working with Joan? Joan's great. I mean, she's really just such a loving, loving, wonderful person. She... Um, is the coolest to ground. She's really on Hollywood, and she's just, you know, a great actress and a cool mom, and um, we had a blast. What was your favorite film or scene to shoot throughout this process? Um, there, there were two that I really, really loved. Um, there's one scene where um, Casey is sitting with her mom, um, and she's really telling her mom, you know, this is, this is what I love, and Joan just sort of made that... Um, emotion easy because I mean it was really funny when we were filming it we we're like laughing and singing you know off off camera and, and they call action we're like okay you know time to get serious um, that was a great scene to film because that was a moment for my character where she's sort of standing up for herself for the first time and then there's a scene with um, Kim Katram who plays my coach um, where I basically tell her that's it this is what I want you know I gave up so much and I'm going after that and that was really awesome because that's the one moment in the movie where I really think Casey's the strongest Kim plays a bit of a different character than we're mm. used to seeing. What was it like seeing her kind of change sides a little bit? 
was great. I mean, I was a huge Sex and the City fan, so I, I you know, I wasn't really sure what to expect, but I think she tackles this role um, completely unlike any character that, that she's played before. I think she does a really great job. It comes through. And this also touches upon the competitive side of ice skating. Mm. What would would you like to comment on that a little bit? And just yeah, I mean, I, uh, ice skating is incredibly competitive. You know, there's it's very cutthroat sport. Um, people are out to get you and 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 hurt you and and do all that kind of stuff. But I think that's to be said in any sport. But I guess with ice skating, it's just a little more. Um, uh, personal. I don't know. It's like, you know, picking off the uh, rhinestones off someone's dress or something, snipping their laces. I've heard about it all. And I just one question that I like to ask everybody. What was it about this industry that made you want to get into acting? Well, I was three years old when I got into acting, so at that point in my life it was about, um, I wanted to be the little girl to, br to uh, brush Barbie's hair on the commercials. I just thought that was the coolest thing. And what made you want to keep going with it? Is it I love it. I feel, you know, most inspired on a set, and I love being different people, and, and, you know, no one ever really knows who an actor is, I think. You, you sort of see them, and you're like, oh, my God, she was so mean in that movie, or, hey, I really, really loved her. And it's like, hmm, well, who, she, who is she? It's mysterious. It's cool.